Today's video is a quick guide on how to beat the Hobgoblin Champion for the Champion's Cape in Old School RuneScape. In order to do this, you need 32 quest points, being a member's world, and also have the Hobgoblin Champion Scroll, which you can get from any Hobgoblins around Gilinor, and it is a 1 in 5,000 drop chance. For those of you guys that don't know, the entrance of the Champion's Guild is south of Rock, and that is where you will go in order to defeat the Hobgoblin Champion. So just teleport to Varrock, run south, and it is just to the south of Varrock. Once you are here, go through the door, and then find this trap door, open it, and then climb down it. So the Hobgoblin is a level 56, and every single boss for the Champion's Cape actually has a special rule. This rule is that you cannot use melee, so you have to use range or magic in order to kill this boss. So do not bring in melee and then complain to me in the comment section that you couldn't kill the boss. You literally cannot attack him with melee attacks. Keep that in mind. Ranger magic. For me personally, I'm going to be using magic. I have a trident and a mage setup. Kind of scuff because I'm an Iron Man, so not magic, but it is what it is. For your inventory, make sure you bring some food or prayer pots if you're a lower level. But if you're a lower level, I highly recommend getting to a higher level because if you die or have to teleport out, you actually lose the champion scroll and have to get the 1 in 5k drop from Hobgoblins once again. And ain't nobody got time for that. With all of that said and out of the way, once you are down here, you can go ahead and use the Hobgoblin champion scroll on Larxus. He will ask you if you actually want to do the fight, and he will tell you the special rule. Again, the fight, you are not allowed to use melee attacks, which is fine, because we have a trident. Say yes, and then the trap door opens up, so go ahead and climb down that. There is a door here, so go ahead and walk through the door. And then there's the hobgoblin. You can just go ahead and smack him. Again, if you're a higher level, this won't take very long. If you're a lower level, good luck. But again, you can actually use prayers here, so you can pray if you need to, so just keep that in mind. Once the Hobgoblin is dead, you will get 232 Slayer XP and 232 Hit Point XP. After that, you can go ahead and open the door again, and then climb up the ladder. After you climb up the ladder, you can go to the north, and there's a chest of champions. Go ahead and click on that. There's actually an extra reward. It'll say, well done, you've defeated the Hobgoblin champion. Go ahead and click here for your reward. And then you get a champion's lamp. You can go ahead and use it for 2,320 XP in Slayer and Hit Points. So I'll ask you if you want to proceed. You do you. And that is it. So with that said, that is all there is to killing the Hobgoblin Champion. If you guys haven't seen my quick guide or the most efficient ways to get any of the champion scrolls, make sure you check those out on my channel. I also will be doing boss guides for all the champions to get the champion scape, so keep that in mind. And thank you guys for watching, I hope you enjoyed. If you did, make sure you subscribe to the channel, leave a like for the algorithm. If you have any questions or comments, leave them down below, and I will see you guys in the next one. Peace. Turn up the summer vibes. Get off your phone one time, which will come outside. Cause we all here chilling. Yeah, it's the same, all same, all same. No, we don't play, no play, no games. Oh, they wanna talk, 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 talk. Why they gotta hate on, hate on me, damn. But I ain't not tripping. I'm fly as a pigeon. This girl's been nice.